Hi everyone, Natalie here to show you how amazing our brand new The Free Girl Style molds are for baking some yummy chocolates and cupcake toppers. Here are our brand new home baker molds. The wax seals one, such perfect cupcake toppers are from the North Pole Waxes mold. And I am also going to use our redesign with Prima Cheerful Cup, so cute. Okay, I need to show you this cute mouse again, right? I'm just so obsessed with this mouse. For this recipe, I am going to use different kinds of melting chocolate. Red, white chocolate, milk chocolate. So let's start! This is our first tape, our Yumi chocolates. I use chocolate dropper, I bought them on Amazon. They are super cheap and make the process of filling the mold so easy. You can also use a spoon, of course, but for the intricate parts, it's so much easier to use these droppers. Okay, I just want to remind you that all, I mean all our molds are food safe. Can you already picture all the possibilities here? There's crazy. You can also get creative and use different chocolates, like milk chocolate, and then you can add a second layer using a different color of chocolate, like white chocolate or whatever. This is what I am doing here with a che cheerful cup mold. Look how amazing they look. Here I am adding some edible god flakes. Our cupcake toppers are going to be so shiny, shiny, adorable. Okay, all our homemade pretty chocolate are done. Now it's time to put them in the fridge and let them solidify. We are going to jump into the second part of this recipe, the cakes. Here are all the ingredients you need. Mix exactly half a cup of very soft butter and half a cup of sugar with an electric mixer until the mixture becomes light and fluffy. Preheat your oven to about 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Add two eggs, one at a time. Then gradually add one cup of flour a pinch of salt and one tablespoon of baking powder. Mix very well all these ingredients together. Then incorporate four tablespoons of milk and the flour of your choice. Here I am adding one teaspoon of vanilla. You can find all the ingredients on the description box below. It's time to fill our muffin tins or cupcake molds. Here I am using two different colors. Some are red and some look like paper craft. Fill your muffin tin with two tablespoons approximately and then bake in the oven for 20 minutes. Look how yummy they look. We are going to jump into the next step and let them cool. And voila! Here they are, our yummy chocolates and cupcake toppers. Look how gorgeous they are, those details! Isn't it amazing to create such beautiful homemade chocolate so easily? Christmas versions? Of course! Look at this snowflake! All the pretty details with uh, shiny gold flakes. It's just so amazing. I mean, don't you want to eat them right now? <laughs> okay, for this step, I just want to show you different possibilities. You can leave them just as they are. I think they are simply stunning. But you can also play around with edible pens and glitter to highlight the mold's detailed design. I just think it's a super fun activity to do with your kiddos.
Now that our cakes are all cooled down, we can add the toppings. You can bake your own toppings here to our homemade, the chocolate mousse and the mascarpone vanilla whipping cream. I can share the recipes if you want, just, just ask. The red one is a ready to use frosting I bought at Michael's and the color is really gorgeous. To be honest, I use different piping bags for each frosting and different tips to create various design. Just enjoy the process and be creative. You can add anything you want on top of them, sprinkle some little sugar element or here I am adding those pretty gold flakes because I really love them and I think they look perfect for our own baker and Christmas cupcakes theme. Here we are, we are almost done here, but for the last, last step, I am a paper crafter, you know, so I thought this cupcake needs some pretty little addition. Super easy to create with our own baker and from the North Pole Paper Collection's ephemera packs. Look at those adorable designs, aren't they just perfect? All you need is Dollar Tree toothpicks, a glue gun, and we are ready to go. Just glue them with a, your glue gun, so quick and easy, and voila! The cutest do-it-yourself cupcake toppers ever. You can also do the same with Prima flowers, of course. Now it's time to add the final touches to our cupcakes. We are going to decorate them with our yummy chocolates and the cupcake toppers. Look at the result. What do you think? Don't you want to eat them right away? Okay, I think it's time to stop talking with my Frenchy accent and let you soon swoon over these cupcakes we just made. Thank you so much for watching this video. Remember, all our redesign and Prima molds are food safe. So there is so much you can do with them. Product list and ingredients are in the description box below. Until next time, be creative. Bye-bye.